Perfect patient is probably somebody who comes in already excited about it, is doing the procedure for herself, not for anybody else, is typically healthy, uh, takes good care of themselves, maybe exercises in good physical shape. Uh, a patient who comes in who is uh, honest with themselves and what they're trying to improve is going to be the patient that when you get the result you desire is going to be the happiest patient. A patient, you have to set the realistic expectations for the patient. It has to be somebody who's realistic. Sometimes people who are trying to be somebody else are bad patients. Uh, they're, they're, you're not going to be happy because you're not going to make them somebody else. They're still going to be the same person. It's just an improved upgrade of that person. I think the perfect patient is someone who has very realistic expectations. They're able to listen to the pros and cons of what we tell them as far as what their optimal results will be, what we can do, what we can't do. I think understanding what's not possible is as important as understanding what we can do. Ultimately, it comes down to the patient wanting it for themselves and not because somebody else wants them to have the surgery done. What job do they do? Are they a mom or a dad and how many kids they have? I like to get to know them first, before I even ask them what they're there for. And that gives me a lot of information about where they're coming from, gives me a chance to get to know the person, and then at that point we focus down on what they're interested in doing. I, I will then usually enter the consultation room and review their history and then ask what they're interested in. They may have multiple things written down or they just may be interested in one or two things. So I try to pinpoint what they're interested in with this consultation and take the time with them to go over all the pros and cons. We like to explain to them with diagrams and brochures that we have exactly what the medical procedure and surgical procedure will involve, what their expected recovery is, and we even have uh, post-operative photos they can review afterwards. Typically what we do is we do a full interview with them. We come in and bring them into the office. It's very, very laid back. This isn't a pressured situation where we expect when they're here that they're going to schedule their surgery right away. So it's really about them. Uh, and we just want to find a good history about why they're here and whether they're a good candidate for the procedure. Uh, we do a very thorough physical examination, just make sure that everything is um, what we would expect and what the patient would expect. And then you outline a plan for what would be the best options for them.